Here is a question about CapCut. Do I use the desktop version or the browser version? The answer is use both. Desktop version is infinitely more powerful. It has many more features and it is very fast. So obviously for all the editing work, you use the desktop version. Then why use browser version? Well, because CapCut has so many things. Hundreds of text templates, text animations, stickers, effects, transitions, video animations, filters and media. The real problem is how do you choose the right one in the right place. So for this video, I have two projects open. One is the desktop version, which has desktop or browser written. And then I have the browser version open, which has sample written. For example, I'm going to try and choose text templates. Now, if you go to the desktop version and look at the text templates, the problem is all these text templates are animated, but the animation is visible only when I take the mouse cursor there. Because there are hundreds of them, it is very difficult and cumbersome to find the right text template. I'm going to do the same thing on browser version. We go to text templates, trending, and look at the difference. Without me doing anything, all animations are visible. No extra effort. So all that you have to do is crawl, look at the ones you like, and choose it. The problem now is how do I choose it in desktop version? And the answer is twofold. Either you use the favorites, or if there is a name and there is a search available in desktop, you can search on it. In either case, choosing the right one is much easier. So for this to work properly, what do you need to do? Create a sample project and keep it open on the browser. We need two videos with some transition applied. Then we need some voiceover and then based on that voiceover, I need captions. And finally, I need a text box. Once all this is set, you can reuse this project all the time. The idea is, depending on what I am trying to choose from, I will use the correct element in the project. This combination of desktop and browser gives you best of both worlds. So try this out. Let me know your feedback. Share it with everyone. And then give me ideas for more videos. That's it for now. See you soon. Thank you.